Okay, right now we're going to introduce you to the three sisters. <laughs> Who knows what the three sisters are? Yep, the bean. So these are the three sisters. Now they're called the three sisters for a reason. Because the corn, which is the eldest of the three sisters, is the foundation. She is the one, uh, as you know, she grows tall. And the beans, we plant them together. Three seeds, corn, bean, and squash, are put into the same hole. And so the corn grows tall. The beans wrap around the corn. And the squash, or pumpkins, or zucchinis, that's all the same family. They love the shade underneath the corn. So you'll see the squash grows low. But there's something special about the squash, the pumpkin. The pumpkin, or anything in that family that grows on a vine, like uh, cords, anything. These things are like the youngest, the younger sister. And like when you're in the family, the younger sister or the younger sibling is always the one that's allowed to play. The older one has to look after uh, the others, you know, that kind of stuff. So the squash, the pumpkin, this is the, uh, is the one that is allowed to play, to have fun. This is the reason why people always say, I don't know if you've ever heard of this, but for people who garden, who have gardens, when they have children, they call their children my little pumpkin because uh, people relate to that. They know that the pumpkin or the squash is like the, a beautiful little child that you allow to roam free in your garden to be free. So we're going to introduce you to them. And today, like I said, uh, again, we're lucky we have another special guest. It's only because he's special. <laughs> my older brother, Kanahorodu. Uh, He's gonna introduce himself, he'll explain uh, his name and the song, but uh, we're gonna take you into the garden. Now, when you are in the garden, you're gonna be following us in our song. Be very respectful in the garden. You gotta be very careful because those three sisters are delicate. They need to be cared for, they need to be loved. So when you are going to be following us through the garden, have that in your mind, the love for those three sisters. And you think of your own family. Think of your sisters, your brothers. Think of your mother. Think of your father. Love. This is what this garden is. This is our sacred ceremonial garden. It is the love of our Mother Earth. We call this garden Unguanaritsta. Unguanaritsta means the umbilical cord. Does everybody know what an umbilical cord is? The umbilical cord provides you food when you are in the belly of your mother. And so this garden here is on Guanaritsta. This is the umbilical cord from our mother earth. This is how our mother earth feeds the people. And so we have to be respectful of it. Yo, we, yo, we, yo, we, yo, we, yo. 